Since 1988, John Swire and Sons has owned and managed Clyde Agriculture. In that time, Clyde has become recognised as one of Australia's major agricultural producers. It's a profitable business, built on premium assets, with industry-leading technology and practices integrated under sound creative management. Australian agriculture has long held a powerful attraction for astute investors. But current global trends make it more attractive than ever. Throughout the world, urbanisation is swallowing productive land. World population will increase to 9 billion by 2050. And by 2030, without increases in food production, the world will struggle to feed itself. Rapidly growing affluence in India and Asia is driving demand for higher protein meat and grain, as well as better quality foodstuffs. Increased demand for textiles and clothing is also encouraging fibre production and prices. So businesses which contribute to the supply of food and fibre in Asia and the rest of the world have a positive outlook for profit and asset growth. Clyde Agriculture is one such business, uniquely combining food and fibre production in a stable, safe investment environment. The sale of Clyde Agriculture presents a unique opportunity to acquire a highly strategic business position for the future. Clyde Agriculture's mission is to be the most respected agricultural company in Australia. Its achievements speak for themselves. On its 12 properties in northern New South Wales, totalling 165,000 hectares, the company is a major producer of cotton, wheat and coarse grains, cattle, sheep and wool, managed through three production systems. At full output, in a typical year, Clyde's sales place it amongst the largest agricultural production businesses in Australia. At Clyde, we have an investment philosophy that stems across 20 to 40 per cent of our total portfolio between livestock, irrigation and dry land farming. The reason we do this is that over the years we believe that there will be highs and lows in each of those commodities, so we aim to be as efficient as we can in each of those so that during those highs and lows we have relatively smooth earnings. Active hedging of commodity prices is key to managing risk. 65% of Clyde's grain and cotton is hedged or forward sold prior to harvest. Twelve properties form the company's land holdings. The business has a well-balanced mix of production systems and commodities, spreading risk through an integrated geographically and commodity diverse production base. Well-developed transport routes connect the properties to each other, to major Australian markets and export gateways, and to Australia's commercial capital, Sydney, where the company has its headquarters. In the private light aircraft, all the properties are within easy reach of Sydney and Brisbane. As well as its agricultural properties, the company owns a cotton gin at Burke in western New South Wales providing a secure strategic position in the processing of Clyde's core irrigated crop. The gin seasonal capacity is as much as 70,000 bales. Each of the properties is chosen for its superior production potential. The company has built value and productivity through a continuous program of property upgrades, including, where appropriate, pastures, roads and lanes, buildings, machinery and fencing. As individual assets, the market appeal of each property is strong. Together, under Clyde's management, they form an ongoing successful business, delivering enhanced shareholder value. The current five-year corporate strategy, in place since 2008, is on track. Per unit cost of production is being driven down across the business. Annual benchmarking shows that on this measure, Clyde is amongst the best in the industry. The company is also a leader in adopting the latest farming technology research, particularly in the area of precision agriculture. The ongoing partnership with the Cooperative Research Centre for Spatial Information links Clyde closely to new developments in this field. It's a culture that Clyde senior managers readily embrace. A controlled traffic farming system is where we use a combination of 12 metre, 24 metre machines operating under a Green Star guidance system of two centimetre accuracy 
which allows us to control our inputs such as fuel, labour, fertiliser and maximise our efficiency in machinery through reduced overlap. Irrigation water is a key asset, with on-farm storage totalling 56,000 megalitres. Clyde's capacity to harvest up to 38,000 megalitres of river flows, manage for minimum loss through evaporation, and use this vital resource efficiently, places it at the forefront of Australian irrigators. We use predominantly a flood irrigation system through a series of, of um, siphons. We uh, spend a lot of time trying to improve our, our uh, efficiency of our application techniques. We um, use siphon meters and, and to assess, help assess irrigation, individual irrigation efficiency. It's all about converting water, a megalitre of water, into as many bales of cotton or, or tonnes of grain. In livestock production, sophisticated electronic herd and flock management technology is driving faster genetic improvement. Livestock traceback databases are also aiding the development of direct, trusted relationships along the supply chain. It's allowed us to track individual animals on, and their performance. Um, we use auto drafters on the cattle and the sheep. Um, we can follow genetic traits, uh, weight gains, daily weight gains, one particular breed or a, um, a particular sire um, and track, trace a, a mob or an individual animal on how they go. With just 80 full-time staff, the quality, safety and loyalty of Clyde's people is critical to its success. At Clyde Agriculture we take occupational health and safety very seriously. We have a OHS officer. We use Dari's software system to monitor all our hazards um, and mitigate those risks where we identify them. We have a stated objective of zero lost time injury and we're seriously working towards that goal. And the company is a responsible custodian of the land and the wider environment. Implementation of an environmental management system is on track for the end of 2010 and Clyde is well positioned to capitalise on future carbon markets. The astute investor will recognise that Clyde Agriculture offers a unique opportunity to get into this sector with minimum risk because we already have established um, farm management systems, accounting systems, we have very good staff and we have a unique diversity of agricultural production systems and commodities that we produce. Across the business, 2010 seasonal conditions are excellent. Water storages are full, commodity prices are solid and capital gains are strong as investors are increasingly drawn to Australian agriculture for its position in the world food and fibre market. Clyde Agriculture is an ongoing successful business built through more than 20 years of sound management within the Swire group of companies. Its core assets are among the best agricultural properties Australia has to offer and the strategic geographic and commodity mix ensures effective risk management. With Clyde's commodities increasingly in high demand worldwide, it's a premium company, positioned for strong operating profits and longer term capital gain. The sale of Clyde Agriculture represents a rare opportunity to invest in a successful business with a unique property portfolio and an experienced and committed management team.